What's the reduced mass of two protons? What's the formula for reduced mass? M1, M2 over M1 plus M2. So what's the mass of a proton? One atomic mass unit. So 1U times 1U divided by 1U plus 1U. One half U, okay, and you can change that to uh, kilograms if you want to. What's the reduced mass of an electron and a proton? Okay, okay so mass of electron, mass of proton divided by mass of electron plus mass of proton. Again, let's do some simplifying approximations here. If I were to ignore that, by how much will I be in error? Not a whole lot, right? That's, that's 1,837 times less than the mass of the proton. So instead of, uh, you know, let's see, instead of 1.000 something, I have 1.00 something else. It's very close, so I can ignore that one. And so that's approximately equal to, we say, mass of electron, mass of proton, divided by mass of proton. How can we simplify this? Mass of proton cancels out. So the reduced mass of an electron and a proton is essentially the mass of the electron. Okay? This one? This one right here? It's so much less than a proton. It's like saying 1 plus 2,000. If you divide this by 2,000, I suppose, well, 1,837. Okay, so 1, if we take one unit of mass as the mass of an electron, that's 1 plus 1,837. If you divide by 1,838, and you divide by 1,837, pretty much the same thing. There's slight difference, okay? In very precise work, that can make a difference. But uh, for practical purposes, we say that the reduced mass, okay, in a, in a hydrogen atom, the reduced mass is essentially that of the electron. The mass of the atom that's moving through its center of mass is essentially the mass of the proton, right? The nucleus. The center of mass is essentially located at the nucleus. And the reduced mass is essentially the mass of the electron. 